Okay, kids, be sure to check your Halloween candy before you eat some. Pfft, as if someone would actually give their pricey devil's lettuce to a bunch of kids. Ew, I only got a bunch of the stupid little strawberries. Hey, Caleb, what did you get? Well, I got candy corn, a can of root beer, Skittles, a Remington ACR, and M&M's. I, I want the, the root beer. beer! It's finally October, which means autumn will bless us with changing leaves, perfect hoodie weather, Halloween sweets, and many more perks. An entire day I get to look in a mirror and not hate myself because I'm in a costume? Freaking score! Thank you, Great Pumpkin! Halloween is a time to get spooky, but with that being said, I was very gullible as a child. What? I can get free diamonds and animal jam on this website? Enter a social security number. Uh, uh, the 33. So being on the internet in the early 2010s and being an impressionable child means I spent many nights being scared of fictional creatures such as Slenderman and Smile Dog. However, because of those experiences, I ended up falling in love with horror shows, movies, games, etc. And I wouldn't have changed anything about that. My mom probably would have, though. Ow! What the fu- Shelby, why aren't you in bed? Because I'm scared of a humanoid creature called the Rake is gonna try to kill me and give me constant psychological anxiety. Also, I'm never playing Sonic the Hedgehog. Go back to bed! So long time Fire Scratch fans may remember this next story. However, just think of this as a remastered version. With better graphics. One time, my little sister was out trick-or-treating in a rock star costume. And in one of the houses in the neighborhood lived an older woman who gave out full cans of pop on Halloween. So you know her house was always at the top of everyone's priority list. This time, she was giving out cans of Pepsi. However, in the year 2010, the only blue cans Kaylee had ever seen in her house were my stepdad's Bud Light cans. What did you get, honey? Mom, Dad, she gave me a beer! No, 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 it's, no, Pepsi. no it's Pepsi! And that's the only really good Halloween story I have. So, rapid fire ratings of all my Halloween costumes through the years. Some years we forgot. 2001, 0 out of 10. Nobody remembers because I was just a stupid freaking baby. 2003, Scooby-Doo, 10 out of 10. I still love Scooby-Doo and Simple Plan really helped out with that. 2004, Bat, 10 out of 10. Look how freaking adorable I was! 2005, Unicorn, 9 out of 10. Super comfortable PJs. 2006, Butterfly, 6 out of 10. That was back when my mom had her we all need a match phase. So she was a bug catcher, I was a butterfly, and Kaylee was a caterpillar. But one oversight was my giant wooden wings kept getting stuck on the car door on the way outside. 2007, Vampire, 7 out of 10. The wig was really itchy, and when we got my fangs, mom wanted to try to wear them after me. Oh wow, these don't taste rubbery. They almost kind of taste like a cookie. It's because I ate a cookie before I tried them on. 2008, Witch, 10 out of 10. Basic, but I loved it. Look how happy I am. 2009, Half Devil, Half Angel, 8 out of 10. Cute costume, and I was quirky. 2010, Black Cat, 9 out of 10. Cute, but doesn't help out with the I'm not a furry case. 2011, Teenage Werewolf, 6 out of 10. Again, doesn't help out with the I'm not a furry case. 2012, Mardi Gras Princess, 7 out of 10. Cool mask, however, I didn't even know what Mardi Gras was. 2014, Rockstar, 5 out of 10. The pink bow and the other accessories kept getting passed around to classmates during the Halloween party, and the entire school ended up getting head lice. 2015, Rainbow Dash, 8 out of 10. Peak My Little Pony face, but I loved the wings. 2016, Joker, 5 out of 10. Bad Joker makeup, but my friend Dustin went as his own superhero named Dustpan. 2017, Freddy Krueger, 8 out of 10. Loved doing the makeup for my face, and I still have the glove to this day. 2018, Pirate, 7 out of 10. I loved the costume, however, it was super cold, so I was outside in the freezing cold handing out candy in a skirt. And lastly, Spider-Man, 10 out of 10. Little kids kept yelling, Spider-Man, at me while I was walking around town. Hey guys, long time no talk. I'm sorry that this video just kind of ended. Nah, I know, poor planning. 
this year for Halloween, I'm gonna dress up as a tiger. And I still swear I'm not a furry. Uh, what we're doing at my work, all the people up front, we're gonna dress as tigers, and then we're gonna have one of our workers go as Joe Exotic, and the Joe Exotic character, he's gonna hand out candy. So, yay! I, I, it's a group. It's, it's not a furry. It's not a furry. So I hope you guys have a good Halloween, and tell me what you guys are gonna dress up for Halloween, if you're even dressing up at all. And fair warning, the next animation is either gonna be in November or December. Um, my finals are in November, so if I can get an animation out, by that point it'll be a full animation like this one. But if not, then we're jumping straight to a Christmas one. So I hope you guys have a good one. See you in the next one.